So I just keep stealthily going at it until I hear from outside of the door, Gary, Gary, what are you doing? And it's my mom. And I'm like, oh, uh, nothing, nothing, mom. I'm not doing anything. She's like, I'm coming over. So I hear her stomping over. I'm like, oh, fuck. And like, yeah, I don't know. Something happens to me wherever, like, I'm, I don't know, I'm whacking it and I'm kind of close to finishing. And like, something bothers me. Like, it scares the nut out of me. And it's just like, Pff. so like, I don't know. This whole thing, I got scared. I, I got so scared it came. And <laughs> fucking, I, none of the cucumber. I'm like, well, fucking, my mom's coming. Like, I'm running out of time. I just have this cucumber full of cum. What, what am I going to do? So I stuff it in a pile of laundry. And she comes in. And I'm like, I pull up my pants. I'm like, oh, I'm just looking for a shirt to take back to work, mom. And she's like, oh, okay. Da, 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 da. She leaves. And I'm like, oh, okay. And I get the cucumber out. And to my fucking absolute horror, all of the nut inside of the cucumber, like, dripped out onto my dad's, like, really awesome, like, sweatshirt. It's, like, everywhere, all over his clothes. I'm like, oh, God, what am I gonna do? You know, I have to go back to work. I can't leave. I can't just come in my dad's laundry and just leave it there. And I have this cucumber I have to get rid of. So I take it with me. And I leave the house. I start walking back to my job with the fucking cucumber and the fucking nut sweatshirt. So, like, the walk back to my, uh, work, by the way, is, like, through the woods. It's, like, through this field, through this walking path, through the woods, to work at this farm that my family is friends with. So I'm like, okay, just on the outskirts of the farm, at the end of my walk, I throw the cucumber in the woods, never to be seen again, and I stash the sweatshirt. Like, like, on a rock, like, right by the entrance. So I go to work, and da 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 this is when the bad part happened. So I'm like at work, like, okay, the thing is stashed. My dad walks over to me with the nut hoodie, like folded up. I don't think he knows what's in it, but there's, there's like stuff in it, you know? And he's like, oh, son, I saw that the sweatshirt was left in the woods. I was just coming to the work to say hi. It's like, oh, okay. And he's like, is it clean or dirty? I'm like, it's dirty. So he's like, okay. And then he just like talked to me. The whole time he's holding my fucking semen in his fucking sweatshirt. And then I get it. We just never talked about it. You know, I don't know if he, he surely must have fucking like I was like I busted. He surely must have found my fucking ejaculate in the sweatshirt. He's just cool like that. I never talked about it. So more of the story is if you're a father and your son fucking comes on your clothes, just don't bring it up. You know, it, it won't happen again. It won't happen again. It was a big accident. Might as well not bring it up. That's basically my story, my horny story. I hope you can relate. I hope if you've done some terrible things, you can feel a little bit better about them now, knowing that I make the same type of mistakes or whatever. Um, God bless you. Don't like, don't subscribe, and leave a nice negative comment down below. Thank you so much. Um, konnichiwa. Also, Kanichiwa. Kanichiwa. Kanichiwa.